All right, Shalom Yashirala. Back again with another Lord with an edifying video through the Spirit, the Prophet, how about Shimei Shai. Before I begin my lesson, I want to give all honor, glory, praises to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Baha Shimei Haushai, Baha Shimra Kakwatash. Next up, the honors to the apostles and to the elders of Great Millstone, who still go out there to the hours and Bibles to preach the truth according to the Bible. And peace, blessings, and safety, and mercy to your items out there, pushing the truth and folk onto the earth with boldness, righteousness, and sincerity. And uh, I just want to make a little uh, a little lesson, man, the spirit, man, you know, about uh, the New Testament condemns homosexuality, man. You know, this, this is not going to be a long lesson. This is just a quick hit. But I just want to just want to push to the spirit, man. So um, this we're going to start it. This is the book of Romans at the 1 verse 26. For this cause, the Most High gave them up to vile affections. Right. For this, the Most High gave, gave these Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans up to vile affections, man. That word vile means filthy, man. Nasty, disgusting. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so we're going to get the affection. This is the definition of affection. Wait, hold on, that's a noun. Let me see. Hold on. Gave them up to vile affection. Um... As a matter of fact, we're going to go with it. A gentle feeling of fondness or liking. Right. So, the, the Most High, Yahweh by Shemiah Shai, gave these Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, these two-thirds up to the nasty, uh, disgusting, filthy, gentle feelings, or gentle a gentle feeling of fondness or liking, to fondness, to nasty fondness, man. Nasty, um... Uh, nasty uh, feelings for each other, man. Fondness, relationship-wise. For even their women, they change the natural use into that which is against nature. Right, that's going in on lesbianism, man. You women have changed the natural use of a woman to that which is against nature, man. Because a woman and a woman can't produce a child, man. That's going against the ways of nature, man. Because a man and a woman produces a child. That's how you repopulate. A woman and a woman cannot produce a child, man. You know that's that's um that's a uh, vowel of that's one of the vowel affections, man. So the New Testament condemns lesbianism and it condemns homosexuality, sodomites, sodomites, which is the same thing. Verse twenty-seven, and likewise also the men leaving the natural use of the woman, right? Because the natural use of a woman is to uh, to bear your children, man. So the women, so the man is not using the natural use of a woman, which is bearing children, man. Let's see what else it says. Burning their lust towards one another, right? Men burning their lust towards one another, meaning pursuing one another, man. Kicking game to one another, trying to get, trying to uh, the acts that you would do to a woman, man. That's what men are doing nowadays, man. So like you, that there's not enough light. You know what I mean? But you can still see me through the. You can still see me. Burn to love towards one another, men with men, working that which seem which is unseemly, right? And we look at that word unseemly, it means a behavior or actions that is not proper or appropriate. Homosexuality is not appropriate, man. Homosexuality is inappropriate, man. This homosexuality should, should be something that's um that should be banned, man. You know, but of course we're living in a wicked rulership, so that's not going to happen, man. You know, well, that's what the word seeming means. Something, basically an action or a behavior that's not appropriate, man. That's inappropriate, man. That's, um, you know, when you, you use profanity in school, they say that's inappropriate. You know what I mean? Which is not tolerable. You know what I mean? That's something that's not supposed to be tolerated. That's something that's not tolerated, man. And that's what the scriptures talk about homosexuality right now. It's not tolerated. You know what I mean? And receiving in themselves that the recompense of the air which is meant. Right, and that word recompense, man, you know what I mean? It means to pay back of the air which was mean, which means getting these diseases and these AIDS and stuff like that, man. The most high putting that judgment on you homosexuals to get the diseases that you get, man. You know? You know? And these Christian churches put uh how should I say they uh they, uh, how you say, uh, they, uh, they hype it up, so to speak, for slangs, 
They um they they um promote it. That's what it is. They promote homosexuality in churches, man. But they supposed to be men of the Lord. They supposed to be men of the Lord, man. You know. But they say that they always say, "Oh, the Old Testament, Old Testament." Well, we just read out the New Testament, the Book of Romans. Paul is that says the same thing that the Old Testament says, man. The homosexuality is not permitted in the kingdom, man. You know what I mean? All you homosexuals gonna get put to death, man. You know, and I got a Bible right now that 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 says homosexuals, man. You know what I'm saying? You know. So like with that, Lord, where this video was edifying for you, I keeps out there that's watching through the Spirit and probably high by Shimei Shai. Before I end this lesson, I want to give all honor and all glory and all praises to the Heavenly Father and to His only begotten Son, Yahweh Bahashim, Yahweh Shai Bahashim Rakakwatash. And next up, the Baan to the apostles and to the elders, the great millstone, who still go out there to the highways and byways to preach the truth according to the Bible. And peace, blessings, and safety, and mercy to you. I can drop that pushing truth in the four corners of the earth with boldness, righteousness, and in sincerity. With that, I say, Shalom, I keep pushing. Kwame Allah, we almost out of here, man.